we also monitor the behavior of the sample, which I, I will show you next. Included in any behavioral analysis by Intezer, which means any analysis in which we execute a file, we also include TTPs. TTPs include the actual behavioral indicators that we identify based on the file's behavior. You can see here a list of these capabilities and also their mapping to the MITRE attack technique matrix. This means that based on the behavior and its severity level, we can determine whether the file is malicious or not, in addition to our existing classification of the code. This can also elaborate on the malware capabilities and what it actually does when it runs. For example, we can see that it attempts to communicate with a dead IP, perhaps uh, another CNC server, which is not uh, available anymore. We can see its HTTP requests, which actually include the malware download from the CNC server. We can see how it executes and what it wrote onto the disk and uh, how it executes with regards to uh, DLLs, um, uh, what it, it actually tries to, to replicate here in the execution. In other cases, we could see whether it has any persistence mechanisms, evasion techniques, lateral movement capabilities, etc.